Sanchez and in this video I'm going to show you how to do this makeup. It's inspired on Kylie's Jenner makeup look. It's the one that she's using on it right now. And the, like the focus of this makeup is this lipstick or her color of lipstick. And I'm going to tell you which color I use from MAC in the video. So if you want to know how to, how to do this makeup, keep watching the video. And I'm going to be giving away one of these things. Of course, it's new. The one that I'm using is mine. And this is the one that I will be giving away. All you have to do is be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Upload a photo of me and tag me in the photo. And it's very important that your account is public because if it's private, I can't see the photos. Okay, I'll do, I'll do your arms. No, no, no. Oh, you're my arms? Yeah, I'm your arms. Okay. <laughs> I can see you. Can you now? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna start hydrating my skin using Hydro Skin Face, that is my everyday face cream. Now I'm gonna prime my skin for that. I'm using Urban Decay Tightening and Brightening Primer. It's gonna help the foundation to look better on the skin, and it's gonna make it last longer. Don't forget to hydrate your lips. Now I'm applying a primer on my lids and up to my brow bone. I'm using Urban Decay Primer Poison and this primer is going to prevent the eyeshadow from creasing and I'm using a brush to blend it. Here I'm shaking my foundation and I normally apply just what is left on the cap. I'm using Bare Skin Foundation from Bare Minerals in the color Fair 004 and I like to apply my foundation spraying a beauty blender with Fix Plus and making tapping motions to blend it. I move on to my eyes and I'm using a matte vanilla eyeshadow. I'm applying to pack the eyeshadow on my eyelid and brow on. The eyeshadow is called Kinky from Smoke Palette by Urban Decay. Now for the crease I'm applying a light color, this is the BH Cosmetics brush palette and I'm using the brown contour color. I'm creating a high crease on the inner corner of the eye to create that sleepy sexy Marilyn Monroe eyes because it's kind of the shape that Kylie has. Now for the liner, I'm using the Real Push Up Liner by Benefit and I'm lining my upper lashes without extending the wing of the eyeliner. Kylie has a thinner eyeliner but I like to do a thicker line for my eye shape. I'm concealing and highlighting my under eye area. I'm using this MAC concealer in the color NC15. To set the foundation and concealer, I'm using the same, pal the same palette from BH Cosmetics. I'm using the light shade next to the white powder. Here I'm contouring my face with the same color I used on the crease of my eyes. I'm shading under my cheekbones and blending upwards. We can shade also the temples to make the face look thinner. I'm contouring also my nose with the same color and a smaller brush. For the blush I'm using the same palette and I'm applying the blush on my cheekbones. Now I'm brushing my eyebrows to keep them the shape that I want and I'm using the Anastasia Brow Pomade in the color Ebony. I like to use first a fluffy angle brush to fill in more naturally my eyebrows and then I use a smaller and more rough angle brush to create a straight line under my eyebrow to define the arch of the eyebrow and to extend it. Now I'm using fake eyelashes to make a more dramatic look on the eyes. And with the same push up liner from Benefit I'm lining my bottom lashes. Then I'm using a blending brush and a little bit of black eyeshadow to blend the line. Now I'm applying two coats of mascara with my favorite mascara from Benefit, they are real. And for the lips, I'm lining and filling them with this lip liner from LA Girl in the color Dark Peach.
The lipstick is the most important part of this look and I'm using MAC lipstick in the color plate pink. It's the closest color from MAC that I found at the store. It's a pink color with a little bit of purple shade and it's gonna make our lips appear fuller. And finally for my hair I'm using the ponytail that I'm giving it away and to use it you just simply tie it on your natural ponytail. It's super super easy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and don't forget to enter in my contest. Love you, bye! Mwah! <laughs>